According to statistics, about 307 suspected cases of measles has been recorded in Nigeria in 2019, while over 700 cases of meningitis has also been observed in at least 15 states across the country. Both of these cases are heat-related infectious airborne diseases, mostly prevalent in the northern part of Nigeria. As part of efforts to prevent or control these diseases, the federal government of Nigeria is set to commence integrated measles and meningitis A vaccination. This was the focus of a one-day media orientation on the vaccination campaign in Abuja. Caregivers should take their children to the clinics. And where there is no clinic, there will definitely be a temporary health post created there with the knowledge of the community leader. So parents should take their children there. What are we trying to do? To make them imbibe the culture of taking children for routine immunization. So the gains of this campaign, the integrated meningitis A and measles campaign, we're going to use on our routine immunization. So that at the end, our routine immunization will be very strong. So in the for vaccination status of that child, the child has to be vaccinated against the measles and for meningitis, I don't need to overemphasize that. Parents and caregivers, happy children in this age group, should endeavor as a matter of duty to bring their children out so, so that they will be vaccinated. And they will be, they will be backing for this vaccination, the top and the index. That backing will be given to, to them and there will be a card that will be issued as evidence that these children have been in so that we don't do no, no vaccination. The vaccination period, which will hold from 16th to 25th November 2019, across over 360 public primary health care centers in Abuja, is set to cover 692,695 children under the age of 5 years. Paul David, CNN News.